Hello dear traders, welcome to InstaForex TV channel. You are watching the weekly link up with me, Anna Kasatkina. In this edition, we are going to discuss recent developments of some major currency pairs. Besides, technical analyst Peter Yakimovich will help us forecast further dynamics of the popular trading instruments. The new year of 2018 started with a pessimistic investor sentiment towards the US dollar. The greenback weakened across the market. Peter, good afternoon. What do you think about it? Where will the euro-dollar pair go next? And can it rise above the September highs to the zone above 1.21? Hello there, traders. Uh, I'm expecting an upward uh, movement on the euro versus US dollar. Uh, basically, what I found is that uh, there is a very strong demand and the buyers are in control of this currency pair, which is a sign that um, selling um, on the shorter perspective looks uh, very risky, in my opinion. Um, the stochastic is um, according to a four-hour uh, four time frame on the oversold zone and um, the key resistance of the euro versus US dollar um, is set to the price of 1.2090. So pay attention, this level uh, This level is very critical for also uh, long-term investors. So um, if, the, if you see the breakout, the clean breakout of 1.2090, then watch for buying opportunities because um, this will confirm further upward continuation of this currency pair. Now, I have placed the Fibonacci expansion levels for the 4 hour frame frame and um, according to the previous swings. And I found basically that um, upward targets at the price of 1.2, um, 1 160. Uh, this was the first upward target. The second upward target to set the price of 1.2265. And the third upward target to set the price of 1.2420. And this is basically the, um, the third expansion level and the extended objective point on this currency pair. So. Uh, um, according to the uh, you know short-term perspective, a strong um, upward trend on this currency pair, uh, successful uh, rejection from monetary retracement, key level 1.2090. Watch for breakout and then first uh, objective target 1.260. Will the pound-dollar pair continue maintaining its upward trend? Uh, on the British pound versus US dollar, I see that there is a good space for further upward movement. What I found basically there is that there is a a uh, very, uh, very strong bullish trend, which is a very good sign that uh, uh, basically demand is in control and uh, any selling looks risky. Stochastic is also over, uh, looks like oversold according to a 4-hour time frame. And there is a successful rejection from Fibonacci retracement to at point two percentage. My guys basically for for, uh, for buying opportunities and uh, first target at 1.3655 uh, and the second uh, take profit level set to the price of 1.3755 uh, and then the final third uh, potential objective uh, target is at the price of 1.3920 which is the last Fibonacci expansion and uh, this is the 161.8 percentage so bullet trend a uh, successful rejection from Fibonacci retracement what are buying opportunities on this currency pair is the further movement of the dollar yen pair clear in your opinion um, I'm a, I found basically on the USD versus Japanese yen that price trading in the sideways range between the 100, 113 point uh, uh, sixty five, which acting like uh, resistance, and 112.05. So there is a uh, 160 uh, pips distance between this resistance and support. And my advice to watch for a uh, breakout um, of support or uh, resistance to confirm further direction. Now, if the price uh, breaks below the 112.05, this will confirm. Uh, potential bearish opportunity and the target will be set uh, at the price of 110.85. Anyway, if you see that the price breaks the 113.65, then watch for a potential target 115.20. Uh, so again, sideways trading range, 160 pips, a distance between the supports and resistance, so watch for a breakout to confirm further direction. Peter, will the commodity currencies be able to maintain strength against the US dollar? The Australian dollar rose quite high despite the lack of investment attractiveness. Um, on the Australian dollar, US dollar, basically, um, I found according to the weekly time frame a very strong formation, very strong uh, chart pattern, and this is a ascending, uh, ascending a triangle. And this was a, uh, building for uh, years, basically. And uh, most recently, the price. Uh, we got a previously uh, breakout in the past of this, which is which confirmed basically that the buyers are in control. And uh, right now we can see that price again going upward and uh, above this major, major resistance from this uh, triangle. So my advice is absolutely to watch for buying opportunities 
especially uh, when I saw that uh, the, there is a four weeks uh, very good closings and higher highs and higher lows according to weekly time frame. So watch for buying opportunities and um, key short term target on those trend dollar US dollars at the price of 0 0.8065. Thank you, Peter, for your valuable trading recommendations and see you next Friday. You've watched the weekly link-up presented by InstaForex expert from Serbia, Petra Yakimovic and me, Anna Kasatkina. Trade at a profit with InstaForex and don't miss our next edition.